Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Shen Place. Welcome to Byzantium here in EU4 Cossacks. We're at our first war with the Ottoman Turks, who inexplicably destroyed all of their forts. Every single one of their forts was free. At least the ones that were either bordering the sea, which most of them were, bordering another nation, which some of them were, or bordering a wasteland, which none of them were. But they had a lot of forts that were bordering the sea. Those were all free forts. I have no idea why they destroyed them, but they did. They destroyed the fort in their capital of Adirn. They destroyed the fort in Kocha Eli, which was free. They destroyed the fort in Yanya, which was free. I mean, I don't know why they're getting rid of these free forts, but they did. So this has just been a walkover. This war has been a stomp fest. We've lost like three battles. Other than that, it's been crushing, crushing, crushing. It's a good war for us. And I think we've worked out a, a decent peace deal. We're going to take a, a whole bunch of clay. I'm tempted to skip Uskup. I think I'm going to skip Uskup and get Elbasan instead. Uh, we're going to take this land in the Balkans, which is going to piss off absolutely no one except the Ottomans and Karman. We're going to take Hudavindigar, which is an important center of trade. And we're going to take Biga so that we can walk back and forth as much as we want. It's kind of a weird situation having all this crap available. I don't know why the Ottomans destroyed their forts. This is Iron Man, and they're a lucky nation, so they shouldn't be just crippling themselves like this, but I, I honestly can't complain. Ask for military access from the Mamluks? For what? For what, Lol Panther? I don't need that. I don't need military access from the Mamluks for anything. At least not right now. Oh, you mean so we can go over here and crush these guys? Well, the problem is the Mamluks hate me, but they hate the Ottomans more. So, yeah, that's a good idea, actually. We'll do that. Puts us over the Diplo limit. Eh, just temporarily. Okay. So now my allies can go all the way through the Mamluks. And that'll help us piece out these guys individually. That's a great idea. I wonder if Morocco will peace out. No? Soon. Soon they will peace out. This war, though, just unexpectedly, they just deleted all their forts. Before before we even declared, they deleted all their forts. Let me clear this guy out of here. I have no idea why they deleted all their forts. Also, it looks like Venice is in trouble. What's up, Venice? He's fighting Ragusa, Aragon, and Naples. You know what? If you're having trouble, then I might want to go to war with the, the knights pretty soon here. The knights have no allies other than Venice. Now, let me go ahead and get a claim. Don't mind me, knights. Don't mind me. Ooh, six unrest in Sio. This province could get Byzantine separatist rebels. I would love to see Byzantine separatist rebels. What's up, Tlemcen? Uh, Crete is not free. Crete has been annexed. We already deleted Crete. Say hellos to Byzantine Crete. Are we playing this for fun or for an achievement? This is for an achievement called Basilius. Ooh, gain a general with 100 tradition? I cannot pass this up. Who did we get? Let's find out. Um. Yes, Theodoros Mikrulakis. Mikrulakis. Holy shit! Fuck. Hello, Theodoros Mikrulakis. Mikrulakis. Welcome. <laughs> Well, that was nice. <laughs> he even got a siege pit, you know, for fun. In case you're wondering, six shock is like the best thing you can have at the start of the game. Shock is king until about, well, until cannons get good. Cannons get good around tech 15. So shock is king for a long time. Well, even though we have access in the Mamluks, it's not really doing anything. 
my allies are not going through the Mamluk's land. I mean, they will eventually, I guess, but they're not doing it yet. Oh my god, did the Ottomans build a fort? The Ottomans built a fort! They're learning! They're evolving! They built a fort! Tunis that medium. Morocco's down to seven, down to six. Yeah, Morocco will peace out soon. Uh-oh. Ottomans getting rebels. Ugh, gross. Gross! Cheatermen's building forts? I know, right? Who lets the Ottomans build forts? That's not cool. I'm gonna go siege it. Because I've got a siege pit. Oh, Armenia and Georgia have gone friendly. Hey! I wonder why they went friendly. You know, I bet it's because we got this Amazeballs general. Oh, hi, Ottomans. Squish. <laughs> oh, shit, I'm fighting the rebels. Oh, let's, let's, this is a good test for our new general. Let's see how well he does. Six shock general. Oh, he's kicking ass. Yeah. Whew. Fighting an army almost twice his size. He gives no fucks. He's like, fuck you, I'm six shock. Alright, well, let's put the speed up to four, and uh, just fast forward through this shit. My allies are doing a good job. For the most part. I guess I can send, um... I'll send the Merc and a friend to go siege some of this stuff. I'm kind of surprised the Mamluks haven't declared on the Ottomans. Like, this is the best opportunity you're ever going to get. Well, we got a claim on Rhodes, so if Venice decides to stay in his silly war for an extended period of time, and it looks like he does want to, then we might be able to get into Rhodes while Venice is distracted. Like, while Venice won't defend him, I mean. It'd be nice. Oh, we got the walls breached. Good, good. Still little stragglers here and there. Gotta fight them down. Fight them down! Portugal declared war on Morocco. Okay, so Morocco's now in another war. He wants peace right away. Done. You got it, baby. Uh, get the fuck out of my war. Okay, Morocco's out. Tlemcen and Tunis will come soon. I'm gonna cancel my access in the Mamluks. No one's going through the, the Mamluks. I'm gonna cancel it. It was a good idea, but we didn't utilize it. Oh shit, there's a Wallachian nationalist. I want them to succeed. So I should probably consider piecing out while these rebels are still around. But he won't take it just yet. We're actually not that far off. What we need is like Tunis to peace out. So if we can get Tunis to peace out while these rebels still exist, I'll be... Why are you guys killing these rebels? Don't kill the rebels. Please don't kill the rebels. Won't somebody please think of the rebels? Oh, don't kill him. Just make him retreat. Make him retreat. Damn it, they fucking killed him. Ugh, gross. That's annoying. <laughs> okay, Tunis sat low. Get out, Tunis. There we go. Oh, man, we, we were literally like a week away from piecing out of the war, and they had to kill the Valachian rebels. Ah, eh, whatever. But hey, there's our peace deal. 53 aggressive expansion, I don't care. Uh, we're gonna get war reps as well, because war reps I think are pretty valuable from the Ottomans. All right, I think we're good to go. I think we're good to go. Let's peace out, baby.
It was a good war, but um, it's time to move on. Oh, glorious. Glorious! I love it. I love it. Ugh. We're definitely going to get revolts down here. It's pretty gross. Uh, nothing we can do about that. Let's get some exhaustion down. Make it a little cheaper to core this shit. I can't even afford who to vend the guard. Not yet. Now, these two I'm not going to core. What I'm going to do is start a fabrication on... Oh, actually, I don't need to. I can release Bulgaria right now because I can fabricate from Albania. Perfect. So that's what I'll do. I'm going to fabricate on Kosovo. I'm going to take Kosovo for myself, and then I'm going to vassalize Serbia. His only ally is Bosnia. It should be easy peasy war. Bosnia and Serbia, they have 19k. Okay, maybe not easy peasy, but not super hard either. The clergy want land. Oh, okay, clergy. You know what? I'll give you Biga, okay? You can have Biga. Are you happy now? No, they're not happy. Okay, well... Um... Whatever, just release Bulgaria. Hi, Bulgaria. Good times. Good times. Ottomans have rivaled us. Big fucking surprise. Check your force limit. Oh, I'm sure it's pretty good. Hey, what's this? Turks driven from the Western Balkans. The forces of the Ottoman Empire have been driven out of the Western Balkans. This is a significant point in our empire's restoration. The Phoenix rises. Plus 50 mil admin and diplo. Nice. Very nice. Okay, what else does that do for us? Not much. We reestablish the theme system. Oh, that's when you own all of Antolia. Okay. Triumph for Greece. Provinces in northern Greece owned by Byzantium. What's northern Greece? Uh, I guess that includes Uskip. Let me check. Regions. Areas. Northern Greece. Oh, man. All right. So I should have taken that province. But what, what would be the benefit of getting that province? Triumph for Greece. Oh, it's just 10 prestige in army. It's not a big deal. Cool. But yeah, there's, there's all these little step-by-step-by-step -step -step progress things where you get prestige and army tradition, which is really nice. Now, the Ottomans didn't want to have forts. I think I do want to have forts. Where do I want it? I want one in Thessaly. Let's see. This one protects this province. Thessaly would protect these provinces. Yeah, that's a good one. But I can't afford a fort right now. We'll build one soon. Man, this cler the clergy and the nobles are so angry. Where can I give clergy land? Still angry. Now they're happy. I'm going to give this to the burgers because it's a uh, center of trade. Lost a claim. That's okay. Bulgaria wants to be a march. Um, maybe? Maybe. I'll consider it. I like how Persia is my ally and they don't even know who we are. They've never heard of us. Oh, look at that. Our name is actually on the map. That is glorious. Byzantium. Oh, I can I can go eat Corfu. Do you have any allies? He does. Hungary. Oh. He might peacefully vassalize, though. 
All right. Oh, oh, I need to look into Venice, right? I don't want to get too distracted here. Let's let's take a look here. If I declared on Rhodes today, would Venice join? He would not. Okay, that's what I wanted to see. Now I need to see how many ships you have. You have four transports, two galleys. Uh, where is my fleet? We're up there. Come on down. I just want to go eat roads while I can. I mean, it's such a good province. Is there a revolt risk advisor? There is not. I wish there were. Uh, can I afford... Yeah, reputation, definitely. I mean, I'm making eight ducats a month. The Ottomans are giving us 2.6 ducats a month. Yeah, I can afford this shit. Whew. All right, fabricate on Serbia. I'm going to take Kosovo and make him a vassal, and then I'll feed him uh, Bosnia. And then I'll next him. Okay, I can core this next month. Or I can start coring it next month. Let the knights transport their mainland, kill their troops, and then siege their fort. That's a good idea, actually. Let them transport their troops somewhere. That makes a lot of sense to me. The Mamluks have declared on the Ottomans. There you go. You knew it was going to happen, right? All right, let's just get this out of the way. Venice dishonored their alliance. Very good. Shit. Cuddlybear89 has resubscribed. Put some love in chat for Mr. and or Mrs. Cuddlybear89. Thank you so much for the support. Ooh, legitimacy. Or prestige. I think the legitimacy is a little better here, even though it's only five. All right, so yeah, let them transport their troops. It's a great idea. Missionary advisor could, could convert to Sunni, perhaps, um, but we need to core these provinces before we can convert. And that's a good question. What what should be our first idea group? Anyone have suggestions for our first idea group? Religious is possible, sure. Looks like he's not transporting troops. He has four transports, he's just not using them. You know, I think the Ottomans are going to win this war. Sure looks like it. Exploration? No. Humanist? Humanist is possible. Trade would be good. Quality? Quality would be good. Quantity? Eh, maybe quantity. Humanist is always good. Diplomatic is good. Administrative is good. Why don't we do a straw poll? You guys want to do a straw poll? I'm sure the mods can arrange it. Make it happen. And just put, a, put in all of the um, idea groups. The music is very loud. Eh, it's fine. All right, let me turn it down just a bit. There. Yeah, he's not transporting his troops, unfortunately. Man, I wish he would.
France and England had a white piece. Interesting. We're both tech six. I think we'll be okay. Now, I wish he would transport his fucking troops. That was a good idea. It just didn't happen. He has a 2-1. I've got a 2-6 or a 1-6 or whatever. My general's way better. But we're going to be taking a negative 2 penalty, and we don't have as many troops. We're taking a negative 2 terrain penalty because we're, we're getting off of a boat. Thankfully, it's not hills or some shit. That'd be bad, but it's not. We might win this alone, but I'm going to pick up some troops. We might win this even without reinforcements. We'll see. You know what? I think we've won. <laughs> but we need reinforcements anyway to siege the fort down. Yeah, we got him. That general is just so good. We didn't even take the negative two. We didn't even take the negative two penalty, did we? Wow. All right, we've maxed relations with Corfu. Do you want to vassalize? No, he doesn't. His base tax is too good. He's the wrong religion. Oh, he converted it to Catholic. Okay. He's the wrong religion, too. Hmm. Interesting. He thinks his military is good. Yeah, I should definitely build up my army. Oh, uh, what do we need? Well, we can't do cannons yet. Let's get two more cav. Get the blockade going. I was going to replace a soldier, a cav with a soldier, but I don't think we need to. It's probably okay. Religious has won the poll. All right, so religious is going to be a first idea group then. That's cool. Are we going to keep Persia as an ally? I think so. He's worth keeping as an ally. That's the thing. And he is worth keeping as an ally. How many points can we store? 1100. Okay, um, I think we need to switch away from, from mill focus. Let's go to admin focus for a while. If we're going to go with religious as a first idea, we might as well go admin focus. Especially since we're conquering a lot of land. Do I play Hearts of Iron 3? I do not. I tried it. I couldn't figure it out. It was just really complicated. It's not a game for the people who are curious. You gotta be like super, super vested interest in that game or else you just get lost like I did. Okay, Rebels never really made any progress. We may still get an Ottoman Revolt, maybe. All right, the Castilian Civil War is over. Interesting, got their alliance back with Portugal, yeah. 
And there goes Rhodes. All right. Give me all your cash and your land. Beautiful. Get in my belly. Love it. Hmm, I have to pick a rival now. Mamluks, maybe? No, it's too early for the Mamluks. Probably Genoa. Who hates Genoa? Maybe Crimea. Who hates Genoa? He's allied to nobody that I care about. Crimea hates him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Genoa's a good one. I want Crimea to like me for now. All right, Genoa. Screw you. Oh, shit. I forgot to embargo the Ottomans. Whoops. Totally forgot to embargo them. Oh, well. What's the cost here? 100 points? All right, not that bad. Is Venice ready to give up the land they hold in Greece? Uh, doesn't look like it. We could try to support rebels. I'm making three ducats a month. Let's, let's try to support rebels here. Why not? Hmm, Bosnia is friendly. If I ally Bosnia and b bring them into a bullshit war against Ragusa, for instance. If I ally Bosnia and declare on Ragusa, will Bosnia join? Maybe. They have a truce, though. Mm. Incompetent diplomacy. Great. Five years of better relations over time penalty. Eh. So that does cause unrest a little bit. This is with this is with the maximum rebel support that I can give. It gives a tiny bit of revolt risk. It's a tiny bit. Venice has rivaled us. All right. Hmm, Serbia, Ferrara, and Savoy. Ooh, that's interesting. If I declare on, if I declare on Serbia, fight Venice at the same time and take Negroponte. That is interesting. Ferrara's weak. Savoy is really weak. Wow, Savoy got crushed. Yeah, that wouldn't be that bad. Serbia's friendly. Hmm. So there's 20,000 troops here. These guys have 20,000. Venice has, I don't know, 10,000? Venice has 18,000. So it's 40,000 troops. How's my favors going? Seven. Okay, tell you, tell you what. As soon as we get Hungary up to 10 favors, I'm going to go to war to vassalize Serbia. And in that war, we'll take Negroponte from Venice. That's my guess. That is my guess. It could work. All right, anyway, that's going to have to do for now. I'll see you next time. Have a good day. Looks like Persia declared now. Fun times.